WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of a very pleasant Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update. We've got a sea of green today. All the U.S. indices that we track, they're trading the upside. Most of the sectors inside the S&P 500 are doing the same. If we take a look at the Dow, it's up 120 points. That's about three-tenths percent. Uh, 2463 is what uh, the S&P is up. That's a half percent, 61 bucks for the NASDAQ, three tenths, one to three tenths for the Russell. That's a 27 point move there. 15 points for the semis. Trannies are up 67. Gold's up $18 in change. Silver is flat. Lights recruit is off 42 cents. Natural gas is back two pennies. 30 year treasury. Bring out a 121.19. That's off four ticks. Let's take a look at what all that means by looking at that nine panel market update chart. We begin the upper left hand side, the ES mini. Trade up new all-time highs. It's above all types of resistance. No reason for it not to continue to move higher. However, that reason could be because on a weekly basis, this is going to complete a TD9 count top. Spot volatility is still above its 50-day exponential moving average. Does the spot volatility know something that we don't know? Spot Voltex, 50 days at 1389 right now, price at 1411. The NQ forming a new all time high today, no topping pattern. It's above all resistance. It may continue to move higher. The US dollar index has attained that one to one A to B equals CD price projection level, the 102.48 area. That means we need to be on the lookout for a bullish reversal candle. For example, you could actually get one today, potentially. That would then confirm a Gartley buy pattern at the same time that gold would be confirming a TD9 count top. So watch the U.S. dollar index. Watch its candle formation. Maybe it's not today. Maybe it is on Monday. I believe that the TD9 count top for gold will complete on Monday. We take a look at silver out here. And this did bottom with the TD9 count pattern, so worth worth watching most certainly. Silver is trading above all resistance. Uh, its next resistance area really is the swing point from back on December the 22nd, 2514. Light speed crude trading in with inside its profiles. It's got support at 77.34. Resistance up at the 79.85 area. Natural gas, which does not have a top, it did generate an A to B equals CD pattern. It then formed a new profile yesterday. And this morning, price tested and held that area, that area being $1.77. As long as price remains above that, this area, this 177, where we're at right now, that is a buy point. For those of you who want to try to take a long trade inside of natural gas. The 30-year treasury, it completed a TD9 count top, and now there's a new profile that is attempting to form below price. That's actually a bullish message. Watch that 122.13 bubble. 30-year trades above that, it's going to head back to its highs from early February. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Ed Show, but if you have to start your Friday, please have a fabulous one. Thanks for joining us. We'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care now.